new Peppa Pig, George Berlin. George Berlin. Peppa and George are driving home with Granny and Grandpa Pig when they see Miss Rabbit's ice cream stand. Let's stop for ice cream, says Granny Pig. Why not? Says Grandpa Pig. I think we deserve it. Peppa, Granny, and Grandpa Pig choose their ice cream. George is next. Dinosaur, raw, says George. I think George wants a dinosaur balloon, says Miss Rabbit. All right, how much is it? Grandpa Pig says, ten pounds, please," said Miss Rabbit. Grandpa Pig thinks the balloon is a bit expensive, but he buys it for George. Hold on tight to it," Miss Rabbit said. But George let go, and the balloon starts to float away. Grandpa Pig quickly grabbed the string. This is very backward, old George. I'll hold it on the way home," said Grandpa Pig. Outside Granny and Grandpa Pig's house, George played with his balloon. George said, "Papa, this is an odd balloon, and if you let it go again." It will go off to the moon, moon! cries George, and he let the balloon go. The balloon goes up and up it. Grandpa Pig catch it just in time. Papa and George have gone indoors to keep the balloon safe. Hello, Polly. Peppa, George has got a new balloon. Grr! cries Polly. Balloon! Both Polly and George love the balloon. Oh no! George cried, letting go of the balloon. The balloon flew all the way out the door. Up the stairs and into the attic. Don't worry, it's safe in here," said Peppa. "Don't worry," said Granny Pig. They follow the balloon up the ladder. The only way out of the attic is the window, and the window is only shut. But the window is not shut. The balloon is kept outside. Your balloon is going to the moon, George," says Papa. "What?" cries George. Just then, Betty Pig arrives to take them home. "Oh dear," says Betty Pig. "There must be something where we can get the balloon back." Cries the Granny Pig. Says Polly Car Carrot. Polly flies high up into the sky and catches the balloons trying in her beak. Polly to the rescue! Cries Grandpa Pig. Polly Parrot has saved the day. Hooray! George cheers. Who's a clever Polly? Says Granny Pig. Who's the clever Polly? Responds Pol Polly Parrot. George, don't let go of your balloon again, says Peppa. Daddy Pig has an idea. I'll tie the balloon to you, right, George? He said. That will it's floating away. George is very happy. He loves his balloon. Everyone loves George's balloon. Snark, 